So today I want to share with you a comment that I get fairly regularly and that is freely. Why do you post such slutty photos of yourself online? And it's usually from women. I get it from men sometimes. I even get it from people in the vegan community and it always gives me a big old sigh because it's just so ridiculous. It's like since when does showing your belly, showing some cleavage, showing your thighs become such a shameful, slutty, classless thing to do? Trashy. So, so trashy. You know, it's like you go to the beach and you see women in the bikinis, you know, bikini tops come off, guys with their chests out, you see a whole lot of flesh and no one bats an eyelid. But then you wear a bikini or heaven forbid, you wear some lingerie and you take a photo, you put it on Instagram, you put it on Facebook, you put it on YouTube and suddenly you become slutty. Where is the sense in that? It is definitely not fair at all. It's like we were born nude. Did we forget that? We're actually born nude, but it became this disgusting, shameful thing like cover yourself up through society's conditioning. We need to go back to that feeling of freedom that we have on the beach. You know, embrace flesh. It's okay. I mean, I'm not saying run down the street nude, do your shopping in the nude because you'll probably be locked up. But I'm saying find a balance. You know, don't be ashamed of your body. I mean, nudity is beautiful. Maybe not everybody, you know, but nudity is a beautiful and a natural thing at the end of the day. I mean, and we come from this society, like the society is like all about what well, seems to be this movement of, you know, making people feel good about themselves, making them feel proud of their body and all that sort of thing. But then when you get there, it's like you get torn down. You know, you get pulled down. You know, don't feel too good about yourself. Don't, you know, post photos of your body being proud because then you're an egomaniac. You're narcissistic. It's like these mixed messages. It's because it makes other people feel, you know, insecure or threatened or something like that. It's rarely about you and just about always about them. So if you're proud of your body, then post your photos. <laughs> Anyone else, you know, if they've got a problem with it, that's their problem, not yours. You know, for instance, I've lost over 40 pounds on this lifestyle and I want to show the results. I want to show the results that I'm getting. I want to inspire other women. I want to inspire you women out there and show you what is possible. You know, what is possible, what's happened for me. I'm not expecting you to look like me or anything like that, but just showing you that you can get fantastic results. And it's so, so important. So if that is slutty, then so be it. I'm going to continue sharing my slutty photos. And you get these double standards in society. Like you get guys, you know, posing with their shirts off, showing their muscles, flexing, being all proud of their bodies, saying thumbnails or on Facebook or Instagram. They get comments like, you know, good on you, bro, lean gains. That's awesome. Looking ripped. And then you have a woman, say, posing in a photo and maybe her nipple showing or something and all hell breaks loose. The world stops, the world comes to a crashing halt because there's a nipple. I say free the nipple, okay? Free the nipples, get them out there. It's about time this double standards bullshit ended. It could be a cool experiment. You know, I know that it, you know, it's, it's going to cause some issues initially, but it's like there's so much stigma attached to the nipples. When men have nipples, women have nipples, animals have nipples, it's just a part of the body, but it's the whole stigma, it's a whole taboo thing around the nipples that has created this whole big issue. So I say free the nipples. Okay, if you're with me, give us a thumbs up if you want to free the nipples. It should be a bit of fun, and it's definitely, you know, they've been suppressed for far too long. So that's my message today. I hope it was helpful in some way and I am going to continue sharing my slutty photos. So don't forget to go for it or root yourself and I'll see you tomorrow. Anyway, and leave your comments down below. What do you think?